Hey Jotformers, this month we want to start by taking a moment to acknowledge the devastation in Turkey and Syria after the February 6th earthquake. We're a company with deep connections to Turkey, and our hearts are with the thousands of people impacted by the tragedy. We're doing all we can to support the nonprofit organizations working on site to provide aid, and any contribution helps. If you're so inclined, you can visit the link in the description below to donate today. Now, on to the rest of the newsletter. First off, we're introducing the Jotform Enterprise mobile app, a reimagined mobile experience for enterprise customers that comes with a host of new features and functionality for use in the office and out in the field. These include a simplified login process for mobile app users, enhanced admin management, plus all the existing benefits of Jotform mobile forms, such as kiosk mode and offline data collection to help gather on-site information, access to Jotform suite of products, and more. With the Jotform Enterprise mobile app, it's never been easier to conduct field service management, routine inspections, or collect data at events and on the go. Next, we're highlighting nine Jotform Enterprise features to accelerate your company's growth. Check out our blog to learn how Jotform Enterprise can make a difference in your organization through impactful features such as single sign-on, white labeling, multi-user capability, a dedicated customer success team, increased security measures, and more. This month, we're also sharing two new case studies that you won't want to miss. First, discover how one of the nation's largest local TV broadcasters, EW Scripps, streamlines U.S. digital ad operations with Jotform through dynamic workflows and online forms. Then, learn how Jotform Enterprise helps popular London restaurant brands expand by eliminating manual data input and seamlessly managing approval processes. That's all for now. Remember to like and subscribe for more updates from Jotform. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.